Tyler, it looked like you came in somewhere around uh, 16th today in the men's B. How did you feel about the course in general? It was a good course. It's just got too much technical stuff for me, a roadie. So, so you didn't really dig it? No. How are you feeling towards cross in general at this at this moment? At this moment, I don't plan on doing another race ever again. You know, I've heard you say that about six times this season, but every time I show up, you rear your ugly head, and I see it out there on the course, and i got to come here two hours early in order to pit for you. Hey, but I do the best pits you've ever seen, right? You do. You're, you're a good pit man. Well, good job today, and uh, you're going to need to get changed so that when my race is on, you're uh, you're ready to rock. i got to take a nap first. <laughs> Tyler Carnes, winner of the B race today. Tyler, I saw you were in a group of three all day. Who were the other guys in the group? Do you know who they were? Uh, Patrick Blair from Adventures from the Cure and a guy named Tim from the Bike Rack, I believe. Did they have any particular strengths on the course that you were concerned about? Uh, a couple of the technical sections, they uh, were gapping me pretty hard, but other than that, I felt pretty confident if it came down to the sprint, so I didn't need to worry about attacking. Did I? Uh, was it was the the sprint finish your plan uh, pretty much the whole way along? Uh, yeah, I mean I started feeling the legs started coming around towards the end, but Patrick put in some good uh, efforts to keep it together. So I figured I my chances were good in the field sprint, so I'd wait till that and see what happened. I noticed going out of the last corner, you were in your little ring up front. That was a little bit of a concern considering the downhill portion of the of the finish, but you're able to come around him. Used to the junior gear, so wasn't a problem. Well, good job today. Congratulations. Thank you.